Hello, Shogi fans. Today we're going to talk about the edge attack and Mino Castle. Mino, many people simply don't know how or when to start it, and I want to show you some easy and powerful examples. First off, we got Silver and Lance. And I know it's about edge attack, but you, you can start with Lance drop right here. And obviously, he cannot take it right because of this powerful Silver drop. And if the gold runs, then you should start attacking on the edge. And if he takes it, uh, you can recapture. And if he recaptures, this silver drop is awesome. Uh, no need to say if he takes it, then you can take the gold, right? And this is threat made and very powerful. But uh, even if uh, he refuses uh, like this, uh, you can still go in. This uh, pawn drop is awesome. And the king cannot take this, but uh, if Lance takes it, uh, again, this silver drop happens. So it's going to be good for you anyway. And you might wonder what if he plays a pawn 9-2. Uh, uh, this piece of is amazing again the king cannot take it and if lance take it again this silver drop how about that okay next one uh this time you got a knight and two pawns and this time uh you can start with a uh, pawn push on the edge and if he takes it a uh, pawn drop and Obviously, um, he cannot take this with knight, right? Because you can drop the pawn on knight four. Uh, so he would take it by the lance, but then you can uh, drop the knight right here. Uh, and the next pawn drop would be amazing. And he, he cannot take this because you can recapture and checking at the same time. Uh, but there is no way to defend Oh, I'm sorry, there is no way to uh, prevent pawn drop from happening. So this is already uh, better for you. And um, if he uh, leaves this this way, uh, then next move will be, uh, next move for you will be last uh, 9-5. And after taking over this bundle position is going to be very powerful because of uh, the next pawn promotion. So um, it's going to be better for you anyway. And right here, uh, if king takes it, what happens? Uh, this looks similar to something uh, what we uh, talked about before uh, in the king tactics video. But this time you got knight, right? And uh, this knight drop is really strong because uh, the king is not right here anymore. So he cannot play this way, right? Obviously, but he cannot play like this anyway because of this promotion. And the gold cannot run this way either because uh, you, this time you can promote uh, your rook on 7-1 uh, and there is no defense. So this is the big difference from uh, the similar one from the previous video. And um, if you're taking Mino side, this is something you should never uh, play because of this amazing night drop. So you have to be careful. All right, next one. Uh, if you see something like this, you might be tempted to play last one five immediately. But uh, Here's something you should be careful of uh, if he has knight in hand. Uh, because if you do it, uh, this checking will happen. And if he has more pieces in hand, that's going to be dangerous, right? Because you have to simply run and he will be able to keep attacking. So instead of this move, um, if you have lance in hand, uh, this is what you are supposed to be doing instead. Uh, this time, 
uh, next last one five is going to be great because you got more support okay so let's see uh, here uh, next promotion is strong right and this time this night drop won't happen because uh, this square is protected right so right here uh, he will play this instead but you can simply take it and he can recapture and you can recapture this time he, uh, you exchange your lance with his knight right and now he's got lance in hand and there is no no way to check your king right because he's got lance and you can still keep going and next pawn drop on 1-4 is going to be great so this is clearly um, good for you that's all for this video i hope you like it and you are more confident in both handling and dealing with the minnow thanks for watching and i see you all next time bye